continued election authority coverage of all the big races you need to prepare for before you hit the polls. That's right. Tonight we take a look at the 45th Senate race, which will have a new person leading the office with Brian Stewart stepping away. That's right. The Republicans, they got a familiar name on the ticket. That's Andrew Chesney, who is no stranger to Springfield. He represents the 89th district of the House since 2018. He plans to bring his conservative views to the Senate, which strongly oppose several of Governor J.B. Pritzker's recent policies, especially when it comes to taxes and abortion. However, he says the biggest issue is the Safety Act, which he believes needs drastic and immediate attention. So the Safety Act has to be repealed. It can be modified, but it really needs to be really needs to be repealed. You have you have Democrats and Republicans, states attorneys throughout the entire state of Illinois. You have everybody that is suing the governor of both political parties that are saying that this is going to make everybody in Northwest Illinois less safe, and we agree with this. His opponent, Gerald Pedraza, took an unusual path to this point as he was a writing candidate during the Democratic primary. He says he's writing to give voters a different option than Chesney. Where Chesney mostly opposes Pritzker, Pedraza backs a lot of the current governor's policies that would include public safety and abortion, which is one of Pedraza's top priorities, guaranteeing rights for people in the state. It, it all folds into one, one major thing, and that is the bifurcation of women's rights, workers' rights, and children's rights. That all comes together and into a quilt, and it can't be separated. Our election preview continues tomorrow with the race for Winnebago County Corner. We introduce you to the two candidates trying to bring trust to an office whose last leader went to jail for official misconduct. Yeah, lots.